In a game full of escalating horrors, I think the research hall is still the scariest area in Bloodborne. This is the Healing Church's sanitarium, where they experiment on innocents in the hopes of creating their own gods. Abused patients beg and scream for death in the hospital beds, or else wander the halls in confusion, or lash out in mindless rage, with their heads grotesquely swollen or entirely cut off. Church hunters patrol the halls, and in the wings, hoary old men direct the experimentation with cruel glee. And it's horrifying in itself, but much more so because it reflects the very real abuse and experimentation that real people have been subjected to. In asylums and care facilities, mentally ill, disabled, and poor people, vulnerable people, have been imprisoned in places like this for centuries and abused and experimented on. There was a time in recent history where lobotomization was a norm, where beatings and electric shock punishment was considered therapy, and stories of violent abuse in these systems still regularly emerge today. So yeah, the horrors of the Nightmare of Menses are scary, but they're also safely fictional, fantastical, clearly unreal. The research hall, on the other hand, is a bloody hand hammering on the fourth wall, threatening to break through. Subscribe here for shorts to see my detailed analysis over on my main channel.